Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. During a press conference on Thursday held to announce the Cochin Shipyard Limited's 50th anniversary, the technical director Bejoy Bhaskar said that Cochin Shipyard Limited will hand over India's first indigenous aircraft carrier IAC Vikrant to Indian Navy next month. IAC will be out for the final sea trial in next couple of weeks. The final sea trial which was scheduled for this month has faced delay and CSL will hand over the IAC to Indian Navy next month after which ship will take the name of INS Vikrant. India's first aircraft carrier will be commissioned on Independence Day in August this year. According to CSL, IAC Vikrant is 60% indigenously made while the remaining 40% of its component are imported. The experience gained in the construction of IAC Vikrant by Cochin Shipyard has been significant. Though the first aircraft took 13 years to build, but now CSL is confident in delivering second aircraft carrier, same as IAC Vikrant, that is 45,000 ton capability in just 5 years. IAC Vikrant uses ski jump technology for launching aircraft on the carrier. However, CSL is also confident in building the aircraft carriers that use electromagnetic aircraft launch system or EMAS system adopted in the western aircraft carriers of US Navy. In a major boost to its capability enhancement, the Coaching Shipyard Limited is constructing a new dry dock at an estimated cost of 1799 crores. In terms of size of the dock and strength of the dock floor, this will be one of the largest dry docks in India. The new dry dock when commissioned will help CSL to have a more diversified product profile. This dual purpose dry dock is planned essentially to tap market potential of repairs, construction of specialized and technologically advanced large vessels such as LNG vessels, jack-up rigs, drill ships, large dredgers, second indigenous aircraft carrier and repair of offshore platforms and larger vessels. The new dry dock can comfortably handle aircraft carriers up to 70,000 ton docking displacement and tankers and merchant vessels of 55,000 ton docking displacement. The dock floor is designed to take a load of 600 ton per meter square. The design caters for sufficient safety margins as per international codes. The new dock is expected to be commissioned by July next year. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.